Okay, so as I said, I'm in a mood. What put you in a mood? A mood. For, any, oh for, for anybody that was here last week, you knew that I was late. And Catboy asked me why I was late. He asked me if I knew what time the show actually started. And my response was last week was my birthday. And Happy last... birthday. Thank you. Ah, your birthday. I turned, I turned 42 last week. Uh... Oh, my. And at the age of 42, <laughs> it's not like Thinker where you're 91. It's not quite that bad, but it's different than when you're 20. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know that you're getting old. You know you're getting to a certain age when somebody gives you an electric toothbrush and you're happy about it. <laughs> you know? Oh, boy, yeah. underwear, my favorite brand. <laughs> like, seriously, this is what my mother did for me, and I was actually ecstatic because my toothbrush was not working for me, and I said to myself, this is how I know I'm getting old. Uh, the other thing that I worry about as I get older, uh, and I don't know if the rest of you people are this way, but I'm a, I'm an extremely vain person. I figure I'm I'm in a wheelchair like I have cerebral palsy, right? I figure I can't have cerebral palsy and be ugly at the same time. <laughs> That's and just so, too much. <laughs> and so every year around my birthday, I start looking around, and you know what I've decided this year. I'm I'm not really I'm I'm still in a pretty good mood about the way that I look because there's some people that have masks on like I've I've gone to Walmart and I've looked around and there's some people that have masks on and to be honest with you when I see the mask I'm glad it's there <laughs> <laughs> Walmart especially you and me, uh. there's some people that really need that help, okay? <laughs> and, and I'm really not looking forward to losing the mask because there's the, the thing about ugly people is most of them don't realize that they're ugly, okay? They're the ones that don't dress appropriately in public. It's always the ugly person that doesn't dress appropriately in public. And it, I'm not... I said person because I'm not necessarily talking about women. I'm mm. also talking about guys. I've seen guys go out in public after the age of 40 wearing shorts. And as good as I, I think I look, I'm not pretty enough to wear shorts after 40 in public where people <laughs> see. Like, I, I, man, this is just one of those things. You cannot do this, but they do. And the women, the women, the women are really getting edgy. I think it's, I think it's the younger generation. I don't know what it is, but it's like they wear less and whatever they're wearing is really tight. You know, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And 110 pounds, like I'm all good with that. The only thing is most people are not 110 pounds. They're most 210 people, pounds. <laughs> that's right. And nobody needs to see that. Like, <laughs> I just Man, don't next. need to see that. <laughs> and, 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 and these are the same people. These are the same people that wonder why they can't meet anybody. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, like, these are the same people that are wondering, how in the world am I 34 or 35 or whatever the number is, and I still haven't met my person? And I want to say to them, have you looked in the mirror? <laughs> <laughs> like, like, it's really, like, I know that not everybody is pretty, but you have to make an effort, folks. <laughs> you really do. You have to make an effort. And 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 tonight is absolutely right. The mirror probably breaks with some of these people. And mm. and and oh I, I seriously, I I mean, come on, folks. 
I'm in a wheelchair. If I know I have to make an effort to stay pretty, you should know <laughs> even more so. I mean, for crying out loud, I've got enough going against me. I don't, I mean, and the, 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 other, the other thing that scares me is, is I'll occasionally find a really good-looking woman that actually knows that she's good-looking and dresses like she's good-looking. But those are also the people that I find that have three kids trailing behind them. <laughs> okay, yeah, I don't need that either, okay? Thank you very much. <laughs> it's, it's like, hey, like, you're being unreasonably you know, picky now. <laughs> no, no I, I don't know that I'm being reasonably unpicky. I have a lot to offer, cat boy. I mean, oh, okay. for yeah, you're love. right about that. Yeah, I right. do. I have a lot to offer. I mean, I'm one of the only guys on the planet that can get you front row parking and everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that guy. Yeah, I'm that guy. And, yeah. and and nobody ever thinks about this, but I have. I'm 42 years old, and I have never really seriously been in trouble in my entire life. And the reason why is not because I don't do bad things. I do plenty of bad things, but I found out at a very early age, if it looked like I was going to get in trouble, all I had to do was roll my eyes up in the back of my head and drool for like 15 minutes. By the time they figured out what's going on, they don't care what I did. <laughs> like it's absolutely amazing, and 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 if if there's somebody that really is not buying the fact that I'm having trouble, when the 15 minutes is over, and I quote unquote come back to myself, and they say I'm not I'm not buying it, I look at them with the biggest puppy dog eyes I can come up with, and yeah. I say. Hi, I'm Jamie, and I like cookies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to you, it works every time, folks. It's un-freaking-believable. Like it's it's, 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 it's un-freaking-believable. The, 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 only, the, the only thing that blows my mind is that all of these years, nobody has really ever caught on to this stuff right like nobody's ever really gotten it like we're in this new woke society where everybody's supposed to be cool and everybody's equal and you know all of this stuff and I nobody has ever really gotten it and and I'm really starting to wonder if I've missed my calling I think huh. I just need it I think I just need to start being offended at everything. Like there, there's all of these people protesting and stuff. Can mm -hmm. you imagine? Can you imagine like 300 handicapped people protesting? <laughs> and when <laughs> and when somebody asks them why they're protesting, somebody looks up and says, "Duh, we can't walk." <laughs> <laughs> Somebody owes us something. Come on! <laughs> and and I, I, I really think that's the key to the whole thing. And, and, and I was talking to somebody the other day, and she was talking about the fact that she had gotten her stimulus check uh -huh. and how awesome the stimulus check was. Mm -hmm. and, and and like this is a person who is around my age who is totally capable of doing whatever she wants to do has a really good paying job and she was really pumped about the stimulus check and I'm thinking to myself I'm in a wheelchair 
If you get a stimulus check, I should get a stimulus lottery jackpot. <laughs> like, <laughs> for crying out loud, do you know how expensive these wheelchairs are? Mm. My, wheel my wheelchair is like paying for half a used car. Yeah. Like, like mm -hmm. it is really bad. And, and what makes me really sad is that I've, I've bought two of these things in my lifetime, right? And never, ever, ever have I seen one with hydraulics that can make me bump as I'm going down the street. Yeah. Like they show with all the with all the fancy cars and all the movies. Nobody's ever really invented that. And so I, I'm deciding that that needs to happen, but mm -hmm. it hasn't, and, and I'm okay with it. I'm not bitter. I'm 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 totally fine. I'm not bitter at all. I just kind of hate life, you know. <laughs> and, 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 and and that's and, <laughs> not and, really. And, no, I I really don't. I really don't. Um, I I I have to admit that when I go to the Walmart. And I see the ugly people. That, that's, that? that's what I feel good about my situation. <laughs> I, I'm crippled, but at least I don't look like that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, and they have <laughs> shitty parking, too. Yes! That's exactly right. They're ugly and they have shitty parking. Sucks. Yeah. And, and like, what gets me? What gets me? And it happens to me all the time. I get people all the time that are like, "Man, it's really gotta suck to be you, right?" Mm. I mean, like, if you ever people will ask me with a straight face, "Have you ever really just wished you could walk?" And my response has always been. Look, I've watched you people walk my entire life, and I gotta be honest, that looks like it hurts. Uh. <laughs> I don't wanna walk. There's some stuff I would like to do if I could walk, but I don't wanna walk. I mean, for crying out loud, if I were you people and I had to park at the back of a Walmart parking lot and walk the whole way, I would literally pass out from exhaustion. <laughs> at best, at this point with my chair, the only thing I end up with is a spring joystick finger. It's, <laughs> it's like I, I can I can go for miles, and and like I'm not I'm not I'm not the fastest guy on, on the planet. I I I don't have the fastest wheelchair ever invented, but I guarantee you. That if you're running from me, you will get tired before my battery will die. Imagine <laughs> <laughs> uh, like, in a wheelchair. <laughs> like seriously, you can run for a little while, but I'm gonna catch you eventually. <laughs> and, and, and this, this, uh, I, I honestly believe. I honestly believe. That uh, that that things are looking up. I, I really honestly believe that that my life is going to change drastically. And the reason I believe that is that at some point these ugly people have to thin out, and by the law of averages. People have to get better looking. Like yeah. it, it just has to happen. It's evolution. Like yeah. it, it has to happen. I can't. I, 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 I feel like here's what I think happened. Here's what I think happened. I think before I was born, God said, "I'm gonna put this guy in a wheelchair, and I have to give him something, so I'm gonna make him pretty." Aww. And 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 there there has to be at least ten other women that he had that conversation about. So I'm mm. I'm just looking. That's all I'm doing. So so all I'm gonna say to you 
ladies and gentlemen, before I get off the stage, is that if you are out in a Walmart or in any other public place and you find a person that's pretty, be aware of one thing. I don't really need them just to be pretty. I need them to have a brain also. And mm. I'm wondering if that's ever going to happen. So <laughs> make sure that you now you're being check unreasonable. on that. Mm. Yes, of course I'm being unreasonable. I'm in a wheelchair. I can do whatever I want. <laughs> <laughs> Who's going to tell me no? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Jamie Jordan, and that's all I've got tonight. Yay! Yay! Give it up for Jamie, Yay, Jamie. everybody. Yay! Thank you, Jamie. You're welcome.